We are witnessing an explosion of new technological breakthroughs. To enlighten investors on the impact of these breakthroughs and the opportunities they will create, we began publishing Big Ideas in 2017. This annual research report highlights the latest developments across innovation, and it offers some of our most provocative research conclusions for the coming year. We hope you enjoy ARC's Big Ideas of 2020. Deep Learning is one of the fundamental computing platforms that's transforming the world today. When I think back over the last 20 years, the most productive period of investing maybe have been from the internet. Since the IPO of Netscape in 1995, the internet as a whole has contributed over $7 trillion to global equity market cap. We believe deep learning, which is a specific form of AI based on training from data and machines that learn by themselves, could generate over $28 trillion over the next 20 years. In the beginning, we were optimistic because we saw such amazing breakthroughs in image recognition, but now we're seeing new breakthroughs in conversational AI. Machines not only understand images and text, they now understand how to speak to us, how to sound like humans, and how to respond in complex business scenarios. Streaming technology is being used to deliver more and more content over the internet. With streaming, consumers have instant access to massive content libraries of video, audio, and games. So how does this translate into an investment opportunity? According to our research, streaming revenue, which is roughly $86 billion today, should reach $390 billion by 2024. Not only is streaming a long-term growth opportunity, ARC believes it is reshaping viewer habits and well on its way to becoming the primary technology behind content distribution. We believe that automakers will transition to EV production as battery costs fall, enabling price parity with like-for-like -like gas-powered cars. The result? Based on Wright's law, we forecast EV sales in 2024 will be 37 million units, roughly six-fold higher than the consensus estimate, and bringing the EV market to over one trillion in revenues. While autonomous ride-hailing may come later than promised, we believe it could be a larger opportunity than originally estimated. In fact, according to our research, if we knew the winners today, we think we would pay one to two trillion dollars for those companies and five trillion by 2024. And today's ride hailing companies are likely not to be the biggest beneficiaries of the future autonomous ride hailing market. Instead, companies that own the full technology stack stand to control the best economics. In the future, we believe that companies in the automotive, logistics, retail, and insurance sectors that do not adapt may become obsolete. Next generation DNA sequencing is the driving force behind the genomic revolution. Since 2003, the cost to sequence a human genome has dropped from nearly $3 billion to less than $1,000 today. And we believe this cost will fall to roughly $200 by 2024. So, what are the implications of this? Well, as costs continue to fall, next gen DNA sequencing should become a standard of care within oncology, enabling clinicians to move accurately track individuals' risk of cancer, treat diagnosed patients, and monitor for the recurrence of disease. Based on these cost declines, we estimate an annual market size of roughly $21 billion in 2024. While we believe next-generation DNA sequencing is a breakthrough technology that investors need to capture, more importantly, NGS should help turn healthcare from the treatment of symptoms into the curing of disease. Just a decade ago, a non-government-backed monetary system seemed neither feasible nor thinkable. And then along comes Bitcoin, an open, neutral, permissionless global monetary system with no reliance on the state, functioning entirely independent of the traditional financial system. Now, since the emergence of Bitcoin, we've witnessed the rise of a global battle amongst monetary systems, both sovereign and non-sovereign, and one in which we think Bitcoin is best equipped to win. If it does, the opportunity could be tremendous. By unlocking a new mechanism to store and transfer value, Bitcoin could serve as a catalyst for currency demonetization in emerging markets, protection utility against arbitrary asset seizure, and a digital store of wealth with the strongest form of jurisdiction neutral property rights. These use cases alone could be a multi-trillion dollar opportunity. 